you know, go ahead. All right, we're going to show you today how to take an impression on the Neodent Grand Morse Aqua Helix implants. These are a typical peak healing abutment right here. We have in the 13 and 14 position for a surgically guided procedure. What we're going to do is we're going to remove the white caps. Find the little screw there. Okay. Good. Two hands on your wrench at all times. Probably better if you tie a little floss tether on there. All right. Take the back cap off. Put that aside. You're going to take the front cap off. Two hands on your wrench at all times. All right. Pull that off. Good. And then this is going to be today a closed tray impression. Because of our vertical space, the open tray is a little difficult on here. We got the first pin in place. We're going to put this just like so. Put that on there. And then we're going to get our second pin in place. And we're going to one hand on the instruments at all times. Place that in just like so. All right, and then you, this closed tray impression, you want to make sure you put this purple cap over top of that here and here. And now we're ready for our impression. I'll blow, I would blow a little air in that focus. <coughs> and we would use a very rigid impression material like we've already done here with that. And when you pull the impression out, these purple caps will be inside the tray. And then you simply remove these impression, closed tray impression posts. Set them aside, grab the other one. One hand on every instrument at all times. Taking that off there. And then we go back and we replace. First thing, we're going to use this tool, our measuring tool. Can you see that? Mm -hmm. right. I want to be able to take a measurement. This will greatly help the laboratory. I'm going to screw that in gently and note where the tissue height is. We're right below the two and a half. I'm going to call it a two millimeter tissue height. And 14 because I always want to round down and then we're going to put it on 13 and we're going to take a look it looks like we're at three and a half there so two and a two I'm going to check that back one one more time and eight one it's up at two and a half so two and a half and three and a half tissue heights so we're going to remember that for our laboratory work form. Relax your jaw for a second while I grab the healing caps. <coughs> we're going to take our healing caps and put them right back into place. One hand on the instrument at all times. You okay? Sometimes there's a little uh -huh. bit of pressure, but that'll go away momentarily. Just a little bit of pressure because as you took off the larger healing cap, and you had a minute or two for the tissue to relax with those smaller pins on there, the tissue sort of swelled back up. <clears throat> but if the patient feels a little pressure, just screw in slowly, and that pressure is usually gone in just a minute or two. You okay? Mm-hmm. All right. Thank you.